okay. what inspired you? <laughs> Normally, I like fashion. When I see people wearing yes. some combination shirts, Ooh. fine shirts. Very nice. Yes. Right here, we are at Garment Technology Center. So this is a fashion designing center that trained students in fashion. Hello. 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 You are welcome. Thank you, ma. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you, my dear? Yeah, I'm fine, ma. How are you too? I'm fine. All right. So, can you tell us a bit about this place? Okay. The name of the place is called Garment Technology Center. Okay. And we train the youth here especially the girl child. Mm -hmm. Though we sew for both sexes, the, the girl child are most welcome here. We train them in how to sew everything that oh. human beings wear. Okay. For the living and the dead. For the living and, and the, the dead. dead. Okay. Yes. And the, our students are trained for two years. After two years, we have to write examination to sit there. And when you did not, you collect your certificate. You can go to Hotel Technical University or any Technical University to do your top up over there. Okay. After the two years. After the two years. Yes. So we normally admit the SHS graduates. When you pass through the system, whatever course you did, you can come and do fashion over there. Okay. Only SHS. Only SHS. We don't take the GSS graduates okay. because we do the course for two years. But if you know how to sew a little, you can come and do one year. Mm -hmm. Then you can go and do your top up at the uh, technical university or any technical university. Okay. If you don't know, know anything about fashion, two years is enough. You know how to sew almost everything. All right. So can we dig deep into like how everything started? Did you okay. always know that you wanted to be a fashion designer? Okay. Normally, <laughs> uh, they feel like they want to be a fashion designer. When they go to the universities, it's difficult for them to catch up over there because now it is, it's an university. So if you know the basis from here, uh, here when you go, it will be easy for you to do the top up over there and you will excel. So we normally train them in the basis. And if the foundation is not good, the building will collapse. So our foundation is very, very strong here. Within two years, you know how to sew. Okay. And so it's very well, very neat and on time to we train them for working on time and we don't train them only the practical, we do theory too. A little theory in addition to the practical so that they can be they can go and do top up. And we also give the advice that they should try to come to us. But those who went to the investors direct from SHS, they normally face some small small challenges because they don't have the basis. So it's good to come to those of us who are in the ground. So you can learn the basis before you do them. Okay. It will be very easy for you to do your proper. Okay. Like talking about fashion design for mm -hmm. your own self. Mm -hmm. Growing up, did you always know that you wanted to be a fashion designer? Okay. What inspired you? <laughs> Normally, I like fashion. When I see people wearing clothes, I like it. So I told myself when I grow up, I'll become a fashion designer. And so when I contest, I decided to go and learn how to do, how to sew. So I went to. I did fashion. Okay. So I started the work and I said, I, know, I need to go and do some top up. So I went back and did my top up over there. And now I started as a training as a, a training center. But now I came into the school. And I'm just waiting for the accreditation. Though I had the provisional one, I'm waiting for the, the well for the accreditation that I can study the paper as a, a school. So all the students are are SHS graduate. Mm. Yeah, oh, they are doing very, very well because, because uh, for when they said those who are not good in school, they do fashion. But it is not true. true. Fashion is a place. So when we have mathematics in fashion, division, subtraction, everything. So if you are not doing well in school, please, if you want to do fashion, you have some challenges. So please, those who are very good in school, they do fashion. Come, come and acquire your skills, garments, the community center for two years, for just two years. years you are good to do. Yeah, how do you, you know, adapt to parents and uh, trends in okay. fashion? Okay, that's a very good question. Uh, now, we, from my point, we learned there was no, no food. Uh -huh. So, you can't eat anything from anywhere, but now we have food. So, if you start from now, you just, just go to your food, you search for it, then you learn it, then you add it to what you were doing. 
Yeah, so we are learning on our phones in addition to the tools that we learned during our training. So what are some of the challenges that you face? When, okay. when teaching the swings. Yeah, in the fashion industry, in the, the work you do, what are some okay. of the challenges? We just need some support from the government because the government is doing SH, uh, free SHS, SHS for the students, but our students are not getting it. They are also uh, citizens. So the government has to get some startup kids for them after the, the work. Any support then during the training is very, very important because some of the students are very important for them to eat when they can. Difficult for them to oh. buy some training materials. Mm -hmm. So we need support from the government, especially, especially for our students. So that they can have the sound mind and then learn the trick. And they just are very good. They are, they are committed to also yeah. if they have sound mind mm -hmm. to, to help them a lot. So we need support from the government. We need support from the government. Yes. <laughs> I hope the leaders in government are listening to us. Anybody who stumbles on this video and you are a leader in government, we need support for the learners. Yes, and in addition to that, we have some less people to go over here. They need support. So if, if there's anybody that we want to support the students here, mm -hmm. so if our hands are open, we we'll just draw the person attention to the person, the person will help them for the training, for the cost of the training, and then anything that the person will be, will be very grateful. Okay. There are people only okay, around here who want to come, but they don't have the support. Yeah, they will come and buy the admission for the plan, they couldn't come. So if someone is over there want to support the student or a girl or two, the person can just call me 024. 327 then the person can support the students here to become their own fashion designer faster and so in about a few years to come like maybe in five years to come what do you envision envision this is wow that's very good very good uh, question my dream is that this place should become a very big institution whereby people will be coming from far away to come and learn this. Because right now we have three classrooms. The first year I'm in one class, and the second year I'm in another country, however year. Oh. Today we close, that's when the group is empty. So the third class is for the beginners, they are in the third class. And I have uh, some people who have been helping me, one man and a woman. So the man is not in today, the lady is in the place. It's with me right now, though we close, we are doing some fishing for some dresses here. And some of the students are also around. So our dream is that from, from now to five years, we want to expand this place. Whereby more people can have access to learning here and become their own masters and mistresses. And we encourage the men to, to come because we are so we are training we train the men also here. We have men who teach the men also here. The men we want you to come, not only the women. So please come, come and learn from us. All right. Uh, can you show us around uh, with some of the things you have created? Some of your designs. Designs. Okay. Yeah. So you can see this dress. It's, it's, we saw it here. Diamond Technology Center. It's one of our handwriting mm -hmm. for a little girl. But we are here to put a uh, piece here to make it very nice. It's fitting dress with uh, uh, three sisters mm -hmm. down here with yeah. flare sleeve and window uh, the neckline here very nice dress uh -huh. this is the bag with a zip okay then this is another one for the same girl i see it this one we didn't finish uh -huh. it, you just read the bidding here with the design here with the same violet waist flesh so we are going to put this thing here we finish with the eyelet so we just put the violet here, then we tie it here. Okay, the same they are very nice. And we have they other things in the them. office, a lot over there. <laughs> and you can see even this one yeah. it's three sisters' dress, two sisters down here, the same thing at the sleeve. Uh -huh. Let me go in where you can see it very well. Uh -huh. ah, it doesn't want to go there. <laughs> so, this is two sisters' dress. Uh -huh. When you come to the room. This dress is for men. It's men's wear. It's wow. a shirt. Okay. Yes, it's for a, 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 a man. So it's so for men to wear. This one is a knitter and top. I want to show you. It's so here. This is a combination shirt. Ooh. Fine shirt. Very nice. Yes. Fine shirt for Are a they... lady. 
ordered or you just sew them down you sell them this one is ordered okay with a meter, the same yellow design mm -hmm. that pockets yes oh, this okay. is the mm -hmm. this is another one a nice jacket. Wow. You can wear it on any outfit. Mm -hmm. When the weather is cold, you put it on. Mm -hmm. You can pack it in the front. Yeah. And others, you have resources yeah. for schools. For schools yes. and organizations. Yes, we go for schools and organizations. And we sew for individuals too. As well. We sew for hotels, <laughs> hospitals, traditional councils. Anybody who needs our services, we can help you. Oh, yes. Thank you so much for Thank your you time. <laughs> Thank you.